To write the name for Ag2O, we first have to think about what type of compound we have here. So for Ag2O, we have a metal and a nonmetal. So we're going to name this as an ionic compound. So to do that, we first write the name of the metal as it appears on the periodic table. Ag, that's silver. Next, we'll write the name for the nonmetal as it appears on the periodic table. So we have oxygen, we go lowercase o. Then we're going to replace the ending with ide. So the name for Ag2O is silver oxide. Ag2O, however, is a bit of a complicated compound. Although it's a transition metal, it normally has this one plus ionic charge. So quite often you'll see it as just silver oxide. Since it has the one plus charge, you could put a one in Roman numerals since it's a transition metal. And that actually is the IUPAC name for Ag2O. However, most of the time you see it written here as just silver oxide. This is Dr. B with the name for Ag2O. Thanks for watching.